Conciseness is good, but clarity is better. I hate those four minute voicemails as much as the next person, but some people have an annoying habit of condensing details at the wrong time, resulting in incomplete information, errors, and hours of rework. A simple illustration from last week's travel will illustrate my point. I checked into the hotel for my five-day stay, unpacked my bags, and discovered I was short on clothes hangers. Housekeeping didn't answer their extension, so I dialed the operator. When she answered, I said, I need one more skirt hanger and one more jacket hanger in room 909, please. Okay, she says, I'll ask housekeeping and have them bring it right up. Forty-five minutes later, there was a knock on the door. The maid stood there with an armful of two dozen or so hangers. I said, oh, thank you, but actually I just needed two hangers, a skirt hanger and a jacket hanger. I pulled those two from the rest of her load, and she says, she looked rather exasperated. Only two? Well, that's what took so long. I've been all over this floor looking for hangers. I had to go through closet after closet to find enough. I wish the operator had just said you needed a skirt hanger and a jacket hanger. In much more serious circumstances than that, providing incomplete details spells disaster for coworkers and customers.